The film director Spike Lee and the actress Jada Pinkett Smith say they will boycott the Oscars after no black actors were nominated for the second year running. The head of the American Academy has promised dramatic change. Laura Trant reports. For all its glory with the glitterati, this year's Oscars face a very public snubbing. Film director Spike Lee has joined actress Jada Pinkett Smith in boycotting the award ceremony. It's over a lack of diversity among nominees. On his Instagram account, he said, how is it possible for the second consecutive year all 20 contenders under the actor category are white? And Jada Pinkett Smith posted a Facebook video saying she'd not be watching nor attending the Oscars. Begging for acknowledgement or even asking diminishes dignity and diminishes power. And we are a dignified people. She's married to Will Smith, who missed out on Best Actor nomination for his part in the film Concussion. The committee also overlooked strong performances from Samuel L. Jackson and actor Idris Elba, who warned British politicians yesterday a lack of diversity was wasting talented performers. The reason I went to America is because the USA has the most famous diversity policy of all, and it's called the American Dream. The problem is the gap between the dream and reality. Following the outcry, the head of the Oscars, Cheryl Boone Hello, Isaacs, everybody. says Good she'll morning. take dramatic action. She describes the, the lack of diversity as heartbreaking. Nice. Spike Lee and Jada Pinkett Smith's announcements were made on Martin Luther King Jr. Day, a national holiday in the U.S. remembering the civil rights leader. For an industry that prides itself on being inclusive, many are puzzled by the diversity issue for the second year running. Laura Trant, BBC News. The headlines are coming up on the BBC News Channel. In a moment, we'll say goodbye, goodbye to viewers on BBC Two. Uh, don't forget, we will have full coverage of the Governor of the Bank of England, Mark Carney, with his first big speech of the year coming up at midday. Now, though, let's catch up with the weather.